the addition of six months of low-dose daily cyclophosphamide and weekly vinorel being two clinically approved chemotherapies, significantly improved five-year overall survival, nearly 13% with uh, few serious side effects uh, with uh, in high-risk embryo and alveolar rhabdomyosarcoma patients. As uh, Dr. Bisogno said, rhabdomyosarcoma is a rare pediatric muscle-derived tumors that are even rarer in adults. In this Italian-led European trial, patients less than 21 years of age who completed standard therapy were el eligible to be randomized to maintenance or um, observation. Um, the results show improved five-year overall survival from 73.7% to 86.5%, thereby establishing maintenance chemotherapy after standard therapy as the standard of care in the European um, consortium. It did take this multinational European cooperative group more than 10 years to complete this trial, demonstrating the rarity of this tumor and difficulty in completing such a trial, but more importantly, how to successfully conduct large and important trials in rare diseases. Since there are slight differences in how rhabdomyosarcomas are treated in the United States versus Europe, these results will need to be tested in the United States with US-based protocols before becoming standard of care in the United States. Also, we'll need to determine if these results are applicable to patients uh, older than 21 years of age who are considered high risk based solely on their age. Even with these caveats, it, this is the first significant treatment advance in this rare cancer in more than 30 years. No doubt, this trial was a home run. Great, thank you. Dr. Bisogno, I have a quick question uh, for you um, about, about this study. This this way of giving chemotherapy, prolonged administration of very low doses, um, has been referred to in the past as metronomic chemotherapy, uh, which when that concept was first introduced now quite a few years ago, uh, was um, thought to potentially kill cancer cells by inhibiting blood vessel formation as much as by directly attacking the cancer cells. Do you think that's what's going on here? It, this might be one of the explanations. There are three, three explanations. I think this, is, this will be debated in the afternoon, the duration, the type of drugs that we are using, and the metronomic approach. Okay. Maybe all together, uh, the, uh, these three different actions have been of benefit for, to increase the survival.